What's up guys, it's S. Filipic, welcome back. Today I'm gonna show you how to make professional photography that it seems like you have been on photo shooting and get a lot of likes on Facebook, which is the whole point of photo. So, let's open it up to see what you actually have to get. The first thing is you have white background. For me, as far as you can see, I put the frame right here and then uh, taped a white paper, simple as that. The second thing is to have a light. For me, I have a light down below. You can use flashlight or something, it doesn't matter, just to make some shadows. That's supposed to be simple as putting one light somewhere. And the last thing is you have to dress like you're going outside. It does not need to be actually good. It can be as simple as that. I have shoes. I actually, there's my um, sandals, not exactly, but I just changed into this. So, let's go. After that, you have to take as many pictures as possible, but with different poses, as far as you can see. You have different poses and pick one. So, after you select the picture that you like the most, let's open the Photoshop, right? So, I'm gonna just drop and drop in Photoshop right here. Here we go. So, first off, the picture is not quite like orientated because it gets hard and so on. So, you go to image, rotation, and this one to get it right. Control uh, minus, it's gonna zoom in and out. Now, we're gonna first off cut and this button is gonna do that so as far as you can see i'm gonna just zoom a bit you see it's not exactly straight line so if you go in the corner you can rotate the image to put it into the straight line like that now be careful to put everything that is not white paper outside this box that's supposed to be simple extremely and a bit lower here we go since right now press enter and we are here now I'm gonna press Ctrl M to bring up this curve. So, if you go up, it's gonna be bright. If you go down, it's gonna be black. That's exactly simple as it is. So, I'm gonna put the white area even more to the white point. As far as you can see, you have to understand that there's supposed to be no white color. You see this part here? That photo is now damaged and you can actually see anything else in just white. So, let's go a bit back. Okay, here it's perfectly cool. You can see behind this white. And let's go black a bit more black as far as you can get a contrast you can just zoom in like this seems nice maybe a bit of that maybe a bit of this you know you can change with different colors different points okay the next step is to press ctrl l i mean ctrl um u um you see u is saturation the first one is saturation that's black and white and that's too much color so you just click random numbers seems good Let's view hue, you can just move with colors, but if you put zero, it's gonna be normal. Now when you're done, you can go to Ctrl M one more time, and which color here is yellow. Now if you go to blue, the opposite of blue, it's obviously yellow, I think. And if you put more blue, you're gonna put yellow away. So just right amount, you see, let's see, without and with. That's yellow, and that's actually more like it. Now let's go to green. Um, you just go up if you see it's better, you go down if it's worse. I'm gonna go a bit up because it seems good. And the red one, let me see if I go down. No, I'm gonna go up. Here you go, perfect. It seems like the wall is white. And this seems good. The last thing, if you put this tool right here, you can actually, um, if you zoom in, you see these lines? If you select it with this tool, it's gonna just remove it. That's the tool in Photoshop. You can even remove your shoe. It doesn't work exactly always, but it works for these parts here. You see, it just removes the background area, so where it should. And you see this line right here? No more longer here. Okay, and after you do that, you just simply upload it in Photoshop, and I'm gonna show the result right now. You see, almost 300 likes. First off, I don't know these people. I actually don't know who they are. And they just posting likes and so on. That was I made this photo like in like five minutes and check out their reactions. It's crazy. So better have this photo than your selfie from phone that looks like a new. But yeah, that's actually it, guys. Um, simple as that. Nothing special. You can post it. Oh, just to show how to save it up. You go file, save us and select here the GPX and press save and it's gonna save your phone. Okay, so that's it guys, my name is Let's Be Peach and see you next time, goodbye.